Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So today I want to answer a question that a lot of people have been asking me a ton recently in regards to the kinds of Dragonstone sales that we can expect to see for uh, this year's 6th anniversary celebration on Global. Now obviously this is a video that's geared towards the pay-to-play players. If you're free-to-play then it doesn't really apply to you unless you're thinking about you know, converting into a pay-to-play player, which honestly, I wouldn't really recommend, but obviously the choice is ultimately up to you. So with all that said, let's uh, jump right into it. And what we see on the screen right now is actually a overview of the sales that we got last year for the fifth anniversary. And for the most part, I think that this year we will be getting essentially the identical, like the exact same sales. There might be one or two minor changes, maybe like one extra pack we can buy, but for the most part, it should be exactly the same. So getting into the sales here from last year, we had the uh, five stones per day at the price of one, which was available once per day. We also have the 50 stones at the price of six stones, but once only, very unfortunate. Definitely the best deal out of all these sales, by the way. Out of all these packs, this 50 Dragon Stones for the price of six is amazing. I wish it was available at least like three or four times, but unfortunately, we only get that once. And then there's gonna be 12 Dragon Stones for over 50% off, once only. 32 Stones for over 50% off, three times, also a pretty good deal. And then the standard 91 Stones for over 20% off for eight times. And then we have two additional packs for some purple dragon stones so the first one is for a purple dragon stone plus a hundred dragon stones on top of that and that's available for three times and then once the dual dokkan festival banner drops or the banners for ui goku and ssb vegeta drops we should be getting an extra purple stone or purple dragon stone pack that's 77 stones plus a purple dragon stone and that's also available three times in total. So obviously I'm sure you guys are interested in the actual prices of these packs, not just the discounts for them. So we're gonna pop over to this other page here. And uh, as you can see, these prices are in US dollars. So depending on where you are in the world, uh, depending on your currency, the prices will be different. But for the five stone daily pack, that's gonna be $1. The 50 stone pack for the price of 6 is only $3.99. Imagine, imagine this was available more than once, man. That'd be amazing. But yeah, only $4 for USD. For 50 stones, for the 12 stones, it's $3. For the 32 stones, it's $8 each or $7.99 each. And that's available three times once again. And then for the 91 stone pack, it's $32.99 for uh, eight total purchases. And uh, as far as the 100 stone pack goes, I couldn't find an image because I think that may, might have become available a little bit later, possibly, or something like that, but um, I couldn't find an image with the 100 stone pack, but I know that's also a thing, so um, I guess it's $46 on JP, but when it comes to global, it should be a little bit cheaper because generally speaking, when you purchase stones in the... Uh, Japanese stone shop it's a little bit more expensive so it was 46 USD for this player on the JP side but I think on global it's probably gonna be something like 40 ish USD for 100 stones plus the purple stone pack and if I remember correctly the 77 stone packs are generally the same price as the 91 stone packs but they do give you the uh, you know purple dragon stone on top of that as a bonus right so it kind of makes up for the lack of dragon stones so uh when it's all said and done if you guys are interested in purchasing all the stone sales which i know some people are like people just feel good about like saving a little bit of money even though it's still kind of expensive in my opinion but you know you feel better about buying the sales as opposed to buying stones full price if you buy everything let's just quickly add things up here on my phone calculator we got the five stones which uh, is available daily. So let's actually do five times roughly 30, let's say 30 for the anniversary. And then we can add the 50 stones, we can add the 12 stone pack, 
the 32 stone pack times 3, the 91 stone pack times 8, and then we can add the 100 stone pack times 3, and also the 77 stone pack times 3. So yeah, if you buy all the sales, theoretically, unless my calculations are off, which could be possible, if you guys uh, find any mistakes in this video, definitely let me know in the comments down below so that other people are also aware, because I don't want to spread any false information. Obviously, if I do, it's not on purpose, that's my bad, but uh, by my calculation, we have 1,567-ish. Uh, not free to play. <laughs> I wish it was free to play. No, not free to play. Um, 1,567 or so stone sales or sale stones available, right? So if you buy all the sales, you should be getting around 1,500 stones in terms of money. Uh, if we do the same calculation quickly, so let's say $30 for the five stone packs, $4 for the 50 stones, $3 for the 12 stones, eight times three for the 32 stone pack, 33 times eight, and then we're adding these packs right there. I'm assuming it's going to be $40 for the 100 stone packs. So that's times three. And then we're also going to be adding, uh, let's do 33 times three for the 77 stone packs with the purple dragon stone. That's going to be about $544. Um, still a lot of money, but you are saving quite a bit overall compared to regular pricing. So... Yeah, there you go, guys. Um, those are roughly the Dragonstone sales you can expect for this year's anniversary. As I said, they might change things up a little bit. Maybe we'll get an extra 32 stone pack, which would be nice. Maybe we'll get an extra 12 stone pack, or maybe they'll, they'll give us like 9 or 10 of the 91 stone packs. But uh, for the most part, it should be very, very similar. So there you go. Hopefully that answers your question. Hopefully that helps some of my pay to play players out there of course i am also one of them um and i do buy all the stone sales in addition to of course uh buying some full price stones as well uh it gets pretty pricey but you know what it's worth it for the content for you know streams for you guys and videos so i don't mind it too much but like i said man if you are free to play try to stay free to play for as long as humanly possible because I think the game might be more enjoyable that way, man. I mean, it, it's been a long time since I've been free to play, but I'm just saying, like, I think it might be a little bit more exciting if you can pull stuff without spending a ton of money. Because sometimes it just gets really sad when you spend a ton of money and still can't pull the new unit, you know what I mean? So, okay, you know what? That's a different topic for a different day. We're gonna leave it at that. There is your stone sale preview and, uh, Hope you guys enjoyed today's video, man. As always, if you liked the video, make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.